so dark. It's currently 8.30, I think. Debbie's eating. And Mac is still sleeping because he is a little teenager. But we're going to do a day in our life today with their newborn and 18 month old. And I'm excited. So, yeah, Gubby's currently eating. Just woke up. And then we'll wake this little sleepy head up after. So I ended up waking. Mac up while feeding Cubby because we're supposed to go park by some fence today earlier than Mac usually wakes up from his nap. So I wanted him to nap earlier. So I'm going to do a little like core workout. And we're going to get these boys up and rolling for the day. Hey. Good morning. <laughs> Can you wake up? You take your binky out and say hi. Peace. I love you. He's this little munchie that's always smiling at his brother. Hi, sweetie. Good morning. So I actually hit six weeks plus party yesterday, which was freaking awesome. I literally cannot believe how fast this has gone by. And I had an appointment for yesterday morning and then they texted me at like seven something. And we're like, oh, your doctor's out for the day. Call in your schedule. And I was like, ugh, the one like appointment you just want to get over with so you can just do everything again. Anyways, so that was on Tuesday. So now my appointment's on Wednesday. Or, sorry, today's Wednesday until Friday, and so not too bad, but yeah, so I'm excited to finally get approved to work out fully and stuff, so I'm currently just going to do a little core exercise with this Aniva, and then we'll eat some breakfast. Where's Dada? Can you say hi? Can you say hi? Yeah, your mom was joking, Matt. Matt made me get up, so I don't know where we're going. What? You need some water? Okay, let's do it. Okay. He's been not wanting to use uh, lids. He's too big. There's no water in there. Here you go. Do you know what color this is? Do you say yellow? All right, we've ate a lot of our breakfast already, huh? Is it yummy? Yummy. Good. You got nanas and waffles, and it's yummy. Oh, mommy. Yeah. So, I don't know if anyone else is picking up on, like, the Jody and Ruby case, but it's actually happening where we live, so that's fun. Um, I had no idea, like, I didn't watch them on YouTube or anything, I had no idea who they even were. But, yeah, um, so I've been keeping up with that because it's, like, extra interesting because it's people from here. And, anyways, I was just watching a video about that and how Jody's niece, I guess you should have, came forth and saying a bunch of stuff, but I was distracted watching a video on that, so... It's so crazy. It makes me so sick. I literally... Are you okay? Okay. Okay. I literally so fetching grateful for these children and I can't even comprehend punishing them or hurting them in the ways that they talk about. But just grateful for where we are and what we have, huh? Are we happy? Yeah. Happy. Alright. Anyways, we're eating breakfast and then we're gonna go shower. Should we go shower? Hopefully Dada will be home soon. The little one's right here. He's starting to get grumpy though. If you can't tell. He he likes to be held and that's it. So. Okay, I get you some dip. Max thing right now is he wants to hold your hand and take you everywhere that he wants, huh? You want my hand? Where do you wanna go?
He found all of these balls on the side of the house that have blown from the storms. Hi, did you find all those balls? Can you go hit one? Go hit it with your golf club. Okay, it's like almost chilly in the shade, so we're sitting in the sun. Get Cubby Boy a little bit of sun. Well, it's not so strong. Um, but wow, it feels freaking nice in the sun. It's literally probably like 70 degrees right now, and it's so beautiful. We try to come out here and play in the morning because our backyard is shaded in the mornings and obviously not in the afternoon. So, yeah, we just come out here and play before it gets too hot. Mac hits the golf club and hits the baseball and plays with all of his thousand balls that he has. So, that's what we're doing now. Hey, what'd you find? Are you going to spray the water? You stinker. Hey, who's home? Who is that? What? Carson? I'm gonna find Dada. So excited. Where is he? <laughs> He's looking underneath. <laughs> Okay, it's currently 10 a.m. And we're gonna put little Munchkin to sleep. He's being on you, he's tired. He probably won't nap too long. His morning naps don't seem to be too long. At least I can now starting to get on a schedule. Like, honestly, the last couple of days. Because when they're newborns, they just sleep and do whatever you want. You just wanna cuddle them. But we're trying to get um, a little more sleep train. Um, I'm like used to being in a bassinet for naps and stuff, so. We're gonna put him to sleep and then we will probably shower and start getting ready for the day. So good night, little bud. Okay, Munchkie is officially asleep and now we are gonna go shower. Okay, so thankfully Carson has been home um, a little more from work. He's actually starting a few new jobs but he's starting his own business, so he's able to be home more, um, which is so freaking nice for me, but it's only in the last, like, another week, and then he's, like, kind of starting an actual job, too. So, uh, what's his name? Ahoy is currently with Carson, um, just eating, I don't know, Carson's eating lunch because he didn't eat breakfast, I don't think Max eating it. And then I'm gonna get a little ready right now. Cubby is back to sleep. Mac woke him up, we took a shower, Mac showered with us, and then he went in and woke Cubby up. So I just put him back to sleep. He'll probably only sleep for like 20 or 30 more minutes, but that's okay. And then we'll go eat lunch. Um, yeah, so I'm honestly curious if anyone else's newborn sleeps on their side because Koi and Cubby both, when they were probably like a week old, started rolling to their side. Um, and that's how I sleep all night. And it's so weird. But, I mean, I get it. Because back sleeping is not comfy for most of us. I know there's some of you out there. Anyway, so, I'm going to get ready real quick. And we'll see what we're up to. Okay. I would record my makeup getting ready routine, but I honestly don't have one. I literally put, like, a little cap in my eyebrows. Always waking up. So, I got to be quick. And mascara on. And that's pretty much it. So, it's not too exciting. Just chilling in Mackie's room, huh? Do you want to hold your brother? I don't think we can call it just his room anymore. Oh, oh no, 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 no. You He'll gotta be him soft. A kiss and say sorry. Say sorry. Covey loves his brother, huh? This is Covey's bed. This is Mac's bed. Neither of them sleep in here. I got cute beds. Yep. This is my old toddler bed. When I was a baby, my great grandpa made it. My likes to play in his bed, but not sleep in his bed. Maybe soon. Hey, Cubby, chatting. 
Hey. He's in his never get open, so Kirsten's getting some sunlight in this room. Here's our nice view. Hi, cutie. And Mac likes to copy everything his dad does. Mac, are you happy today? Do you want to take a nap in your bed? Mm. Mm. Do you want to sleep in your crib? Mm. Yeah? In there? I'm what do you think? Alright, we shall see. It's about nap time for Koi though. Hi, I love you. Oh, thanks, helping him. <laughs> Thank you, boys. Well, I was getting ready, and as you can see, little Munchie decided he's starving right now. So, taking a little break and feeding Cuffy, and then Mac is asleep. And we're gonna get a few things done for the day once he's done and I can finish doing what I need to do. Alright, come in here. It's being very needy today, huh? You just need to be held by mama. Which means my getting ready process is very slow. Oh yeah. Should we go night night? Yeah, you look so sleepy. <laughs> Say goodnight. He was sleeping next to me and then woke up. So here we are. I suck outside for two seconds. It's literally two thirty. I started getting ready at twelve thirty, but the kids have just been needy. Or er, what's his name? Cubby has been a little colicky the last. I don't know. Really, since like Friday. Oh, it feels so bright. And I literally can't look out. It's too bright. Um, yeah, it's been weird. Like, we went to Carson's high school reunion and picked him up, and Carson's mother in law was like, Yeah, he's been crying for like 30 minutes. I don't know what to do for him. I'm like, go good. And he stopped. When we got home, I did it again the next day when we got there, which I think he was just so tired both times, honestly. Um, and then we ended up having to get his lip tie cut on Monday, so a couple days ago, so I think he's honestly just struggling with that. I'm sure it hurts really bad. It looks painful. So, yeah, it's kind of hard, but he's just being hard to console. He's just a sad little boy, and it's okay. I'm just honestly grateful to have him. <laughs> Every time Carson and I complain, we're like, you know what? We have so many friends and people around us, and probably some of you who are struggling, and just waiting for the day to have your little family. And if any of you are struggling, I pray for you literally every day. Um, but yeah, we try to just not complain that much. Obviously we're going to because we're human and it's still hard. Even though we know how lucky we are, sometimes the screaming will get to you. But anyways, so Cubby was just really needy, so I just stopped getting ready. And then I finally got him to calm down and then Mac woke up only after like an hour of napping, I think, because he was up in upstairs by himself. Then woke up scared, and um, so he came downstairs screaming, so then Cubby started crying again. Anyways, so then after an hour of that, I finally started getting ready again. As you can see, I only did half my hair. Well, I just didn't do the top part, because I'm like, just can't put any more effort into doing this. So, that's a wrap, it's 2.30. Koi's awake, sadly, um, didn't get a very good nap, but he was just watching a show in my bed while I was finishing getting ready, and I just stuck out here to make this, and might go to the park, so, but it's also looking very rainy, I'll show you guys. They're honestly pretty cool, though. So, if any of you watched our, one of our most recent vlogs, Kevin was in the hospital for a few days because he got sick from us and um he's doing a lot better though from that so it's been 
like a week and a half now that he's been like getting better so he hasn't had a fever for a week and a half which is good um it's so sad though i still like ugh, makes me sick just thinking about like all the tests he had to get done and stuff but see i wonder i'm squinting because it's like that horrible lighting where it's like cloudy but it just makes it like 10 times more bright for whatever reason so my eyes are burning anyways um yeah that's pretty much the update for now and we'll go get mac ready for the day and see what we do uh, it's officially going in my head. almost 4 p.m. <laughs> this is what we're doing. <laughs> Hope Dada. We need to schedule. We were doing some planning. We were doing some planning of our life, me and Cars, and then both the children decided to come join us. Hi, next to you. It's bad and I'm sleeping. This one's just causing trouble. So this is fun. And no, we still have not figured out our lives. So. But Mac got a new tattoo. You want to show me a tattoo? Cool. Yeah. Loves his mama. Do you like it? <laughs> you being shy? Can you say hi? Say hi, buddy. Wave hi. <laughs> He's like, what is Are on me? I don't think he realizes. Are you flexing? <laughs> show me your muscles. <laughs> <laughs> I just way. push play. <laughs> we are on our way to Wally World. So we are going to Walmart? I thought you wanted to. No, I had no reason to go to Walmart. Let's just go to Harmon's. Or er, Smith's. Smith's. Yeah, cause, well, then we can go back to. I thought you wanted to go. We should have gone to Harmon's. What? I thought you wanted to go to TJ. Hey, let me see what you got. Did Dad find you a toy already? Cool. Is it a toy Dad wants or you want? I also found a Jeep Gladiator, Jurassic Park, and Dino Catcher, which I feel like. You kidding me? RC, <laughs> you Dino kidding Catcher. Me? That's a good start. That's all you gotta say. He's been asleep for like two hours. Getting the best little baby stretches. Stretch. Yeah, this is way longer than five. One, two. Right. Didn't vlog very good at TJ, but <laughs> always. Now. But we got some rugs. Got to update them, bro. Oh yeah, Gotta we got some rugs. The, so we'll show you when hats? we get home. But we didn't open out one. Anyways. We're doing unveiling of a rug. Oh All right, we're doing unveiling. Exciting. House so rugs. exciting. We haven't had a rug there for, well, we'll explain later. Anyways, going to our friends right now. They literally live like four houses down. Going to eat dinner, brought our salad and our babies. We have no idea what we're having, so wasn't sure what kind of salad to make. That felt weird asking. Anyways. All right, hopefully, sorry the sprinklers are on. And hopefully this is even showing me. I'm on my phone, so I have to turn the phone backwards. I can't see. But me and Covey are chilling outside because he has been extra colicky the last week and gets so bad at night. And I don't really know what to do for him, honestly, but he likes being outside and calms down. So we're just sitting out here. Um... We had so much fun at our friend's house. It was the first time we've actually gone to their house. <coughs> and 
It was such a blast. They have four little girls, and Mac was just in heaven. He had so much fun playing. They like Mac loves music and dancing, and they did that on the tramp, and so he had a grand old time. But um, yeah, don't really know what to do for Cubby Boy. Hopefully, it'll pass soon. It's hard because he like won't eat very good when he gets in these moods. So then I'm like, do I pump? Is he gonna want to eat soon? I don't know. And yeah, our night routine definitely usually looks different than this. And Mac actually put himself to sleep tonight. He just was on the bed and by the time Carson and I got in there, he was already out. So I didn't even get a record going to bed with him. So maybe I'll put a snippet in tomorrow of what we actually do. But that's pretty much our day. Me and Covey will just be out here until he decides he wants to eat or calms down so we can go to bed. That'd be great, huh? Until then, we'll be right here. Say goodnight, Cubby boy.